A lot of hugs and a lot of smiles on the faces of Jacksboro students, teachers, staff members, all returning to school and class for the first time since a tornado hit their town. The high school, elementary school, and many homes and buildings were damaged or destroyed by the storms. Fox Force Dion Anglin tells us how the first day back at school went. Meal prep for 500 elementary students in temporary classroom settings. A makeshift playground at First Baptist Church. And a system to get lunch served on a rotating schedule. It's going great. It's going good. The day began with students eagerly embracing the necessary change. Jacksboro ISD recovering from the EF3 tornado that left behind a trail of destruction at two school campuses on Monday, March 21st. We've had so many people helping from out front to the bus line, the car line, people in here. We have so many adults just ready to love on kids and guide them where they need to go. It is a village. It's all hands on deck and it's a beautiful thing to witness. Surveillance video shows the elementary campus principal running down the hallway as the lights go out barely making it to safety before walls start to collapse. Stacy Williams had just arrived to pick up her daughter, a third grader. I was one of the parents in the pickup line. So I had just parked my car and the uh, sirens started going off and I look up and see Mr. Qualls rushing parents in the building. So as soon as we got in the building, we literally saw the gym come down on us. Yeah, so. Today's first day seeing him, so it's kind of emotional. Just take a look at the students' artwork. You got this. You can do anything. It definitely describes it all. Environment-wise, the high school kids had the least amount of disruption as far as their classrooms. You know, the gym area has been destroyed and they're having to work around that. Uh, but resiliency, they're, they're just working through it and I think glad to be somewhat in a routine today. Kindergarten through third grade students should return to their campus in roughly two weeks. Their classroom wing is expected to be repaired by then. Fourth and fifth grade students will likely finish the school year at the middle school campus. In Jacksboro, Dion Anglin, Fox 4 News.